Hello, this is Grandma's Gone Gaming. I'm bringing you episode 13 of my 2016 personal challenge, The Railroad. I have been uh, working on the Eastern Line. And let's see, do I have a car in here other than that one? Let's, yeah, let's just take this one. Let me get in here and go out this way. And I've gone quite a ways. I've taken out the stuff here. And it's hard to talk over the railroad car. All right. I'm gonna get out here, cut that noise down a little bit. Um, I'm using USB sound in it. You might have a little low hum in the background and um, things sound a little different to me in here. I've got the game sounds up so that you can hear the mobs and stuff like that and hopefully not be overwhelming. But when I'm playing it, it sounds a little extra loud for me. Okay, so where I'm going out here is into the edges of the flower forest and also the plains. So I've collected a lot of flowers, <laughs> as you can see, and I kind of thought, well, I will just go ahead and collect them and put them in here a little bit at least because they were kind of taking up extra space and what I did I made a double area here I decided the Eastern uh, Railway is going to have this this type two sides here we will come in one side like this probably to the right and then uh, you know, grab whatever you need out of you know here as you can see there are more flowers and stuff there too um, I have a little bit of track here in my inventory been killing stuff and getting stuff and uh, then over here we've got more tracks so let's kind of make sure wait that's powered rail there we, yeah we don't need that um, I have more iron here and I have a little bit more back at the base I think at the you know the main base but I have everything ready here to wait I actually have more ready here than <laughs> than what I need I have uh, power three unbreaking three bow uh, some arrows. You know, I've got. I have. My daughter keeps getting after me for that. Uh, <laughs> because you know, we uh, do homeschool kids. <laughs> and I know better. I taught her better. And I keep saying the wrong thing. Okay, what is this? Oh, yeah, let's put this over here. It's just more things that I've been collecting. Put that in there. Um, I could use that. I'm, I'm kind of thinking that maybe there might be another taiga or something out here. And actually, you can find the, the dogs in the plains, wolves, stuff, you know, all sorts of stuff. But anyway, this is, uh, get in there, stay. This is what these whistle stops will be, kind of. And I'm thinking that I might find, you know, other things around to put in. Um, I don't want to keep that up for very long. You know, just, just a little kind of dress it up. Now this one was really kind of weird because of the way um, it comes out and the hill that you have to go up and then over here is, uh, let's just go on ahead, go ahead and go out here a little bit. Beautiful plains and I'm going to be going that way to the next whistle stop. So there is flower forest over there, flower forest over here, um, and in the middle plains. So I like the flowers. That's pretty cool. But it would kind of be nice to come up on a few other things. There's some interesting formations over there. Looks like a taiga, perhaps, over there. Looks like right over there. I kind of had hoped to see some villages more again. And there might be. Um, you know, I, I would really like to see an actual taiga village. And look at that strange rock formation over there. Anyway, very pretty. River down here. It's just nice. And it's kind of nice to have an open area, but believe me, this place is full of mobs at night. Yeah, it gets pretty active out here. Been killing a lot of different things out this way. And so, what I have right now here is... Uh, oh, did I make any more fences? I don't think I did. I think I need to collect trees. Let's go take a look and see how much more wood we need here. I've been going through a lot of stuff. And I have been concentrating on the 
Yeah, I don't have any wood at all. Oops, let's go this way. That's where I was looking. It's this one that I want to look at. There we go. Yeah, nothing. I have other blocks, but not... Not wood. Okay, yeah, so that's what we need to do through the rest of this episode, probably, is just go get some trees. And... Uh, where Where's the sun? Oh, well, we're almost down. Maybe I don't want to go get any trees right now. Maybe we should go sleep. Well, hmm. How's my food situation? I have plenty of food. Well, let's just see here. I don't want anything like going in there at night. Why don't we... I need oak, because I started this thing with oak, and there is, there are obviously some birch trees out here, but uh, the plains predominantly is oak, so that's what I'm going with. Look at all those sheep up there. Could have used those in my, uh, my <laughs> Minecraft Hardcore Challenge that I'm just finishing up. Because I needed to build a ship, and my sails for my ship needed wool, and I ended up with one sheep in the area where I was. I, you know, well, if you have been watching that, I'm not going to spoil it for you, because uh, I, I have the episodes all done now, but uh, yeah, I'll just let you discover that. If you haven't been watching it, just look on Grandma's Gone Gaming and find the MHC for August 2016. Minecraft Hardcore Challenge. And I've also been doing the base race that Ed Case of the Mob Cave puts together, which is really just a really neat, fun challenge. Really in, have been enjoying that. He has overhauled it, um, took a little vacation, and then came back with some really neat uh, ways of doing it. I had not done it officially before that, but I have been ever since uh, since he came back with it. Okay, I think we're going to go over here now and climb inside of there. And I think probably rather than, uh, you know, I'm just going to be building onto the railroad, making, putting up fence things and putting in rail and all that kind of stuff. So probably I'll just end this off now just so you can see the progress that I've been making. Isn't that pretty? Look at there. All picture framed. All right, so we'll just go ahead and uh, put this back in here where it was. And I have some nice oak wood that's perfect for making just about enough fence posts to go along. I will need a uh, couple more gates also. Um, the gate here is... did I put it up here? No. I was thinking... there it is, right here. I did put a gate. I like to put a gate near the whistle stop. So that's here to get out into... and I could have been doing that instead of going up through the cobble. But anyway, that's that's what this looks like so far. Yeah, just a little fancier, just because I, I kind of needed something pretty, you know? Sometimes you do. And so there we we, can, we know when we're getting here. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, as I sleep, there we go, I will say goodbye, and I hope that you'll join me in the next episode as we get a little further on the Eastern Line, and thanks for watching. <laughs>